Hey, what's going on guys? Sinister Skater here and we're talking more Call of Duty 16 in particular We're talking about Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered which people are pretty hyped for I'm gonna say I'm pretty interested in checking it out myself Now this video I'm gonna be covering everything that we know about COD 4, how you can get it uh, what it contains, details and images and things like that. It's pretty much being bundled with Infinite Warfare. So if you guys don't know anything about Infinite Warfare, you missed my video earlier and want to know more information, link will be down below in the description. You can go check that out and know everything that you need to know and everything that everybody knows as of right now. So let's get into COD 4 Remastered. First things first, how do you get this thing? The only way you can get Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare Remastered is with Infinite Warfare. There's going to be no separate purchase, and that's the only way you can get it. And with that in mind, COD 4 Remaster is only going to be in a digital format. There's going to be no physical disc or things like that. And I probably should mention, it's only going to be on the current gen consoles right now, Xbox One, PS4, and PC, as the last gen consoles are being left behind, if you guys were unaware about that. So, like I said, COD 4 is being bundled with Infinite Warfare, there's no separate purchase, so the cheapest way to get COD 4 Remastered if you just want to play that is the Legacy Edition, which is going to be $80. That's your minimum price if you want to get COD 4. You're pretty much paying 20 bucks extra for Call of Duty 4. There are other options if you are interested, uh, like worth more money, but I'll be covering that in another video, probably going up tomorrow if it's not up already. Uh, covering all the collector's editions and DLC exclusivity and things like that, and that video will be linked down below in the cards description if you're interested in going to check that out. But what is Call of Duty 4 Remastered? It's pretty much Call of Duty 4 Remastered. We're going to be getting the full campaign. 10 maps at launch at least. I have a feeling that we're going to be getting like DLC packs and downloads for other maps within Call of Duty 4. Probably as their backup plan just in case if uh, Infinite Warfare flops or things like that. That's my opinion. But we're getting full campaign, 10 maps at launch. The uh, We got three maps confirmed as of now. We're going to be getting Crash, Backlot, and Crossfire. And the game just looks really good. Compared, well, it came out in 2007, almost nine years later. Uh, the game looks pretty amazing. They got they update all the textures, lighting, and just like just over the last nine years, there's new tech that's been invented that allows for this overall improvement to the game. And the game looks really, really good from the trailer. Uh, as for like multiplayer and things like that, they revamped the progression system so there's more unlocks. There's like master prestige and things like that. And talking about multiplayer and prestige, your stats and prestige and everything that you've done in Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare, like on Xbox 360 or PS3, is not going to be transferring to the next gen version of the remastered COD 4. The stats are not going to transfer. So, yeah, which I actually, I, what, I don't know. I don't picked up COD 4 late. I, mean, I only proceeded a couple of times, but I'm pretty sure people would like this because say you were new back in the day, you have horrible stats and then you're stuck with them or like, you know, just playing the full game remastered, just immersing yourself in the whole thing again and re-experiencing. I think that's a good thing. Uh, I, I really wouldn't want stats to transfer because that's just kind of defeating the purpose of like re-immersing yourself in Call of Duty 4 in 2016. So that's a cool thing. Oh yeah, one last thing is they said dedicated servers are going to be a thing for Call of Duty 4. People always complain that they want dedicated servers, so they're giving you dedicated servers for COD 4 Remastered. But that's about everything that we know as of now. We got some cool screenshots of uh, COD 4 on the screen, and now you know how to get the game and everything about it that we know as of now. So with that, guys, thanks for watching. So let me know if you're excited for COD 4, and you know if you're more excited for COD 4 than Infinite Warfare, and why. Let me know that down below in the comments. But with that, guys, again, more Infinite Warfare videos will be linked down below in the description and the cards, so you can check those out if they come out. If you're a subscriber watching this, I got three videos coming out this week in addition to, like, a uh, rant video about Infinite Warfare. So that's, like, all the stuff you guys need to know. So as always, guys, thanks for watching. I'm Sinister Skater. Subscribe for future Call of Duty content if you guys enjoy it. Like the video and just, like, if you disliked it. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace out.